This was a long time coming for us, but thankfully <coughs> William Shakespeare explained it beautifully. There was always love when my patient the weird was very wearing very fat. I am not a patient person, but in life sometimes the good things stand still. Lungy has always had this over me. When we first met, she told me for her it was love at first sight. After hearing this, my reply was, yeah, I don't believe in that. Sorry, Lungy, I hope I'm forgiven. However, I do know the exact moment I knew I wanted to spend the rest of my life with you. It was a typical day at 37, when they still had the back house. For whatever reason, something I can't remember, I was having drinks with some of your family out the back. Your sister Toria decided that day to ask me, all of a sudden, amongst the usual idle chit-chat, a very serious question. What's your intentions with my sister? I need to know. I was instantly thrown. I was irritated at the question and Tora, Toria somehow targeting me. I didn't say anything, just sulked quietly. But I did think about that question. My first silent answer that popped in my head was, obviously I'm with your sister, how dare you ask? <laughs> then the irritation left and I seriously thought about Lungi and what she meant to me. The second answer came easily. I loved her and I couldn't think of my life without you. Are you sure? <laughs> Obviously, I've never shared this till now. Toria never asked again. But in asking that fate, fateful question, she never knew what impact it had on me. No one did. Sorry, I'm a quiet and reserved Barlangi. <laughs> but today, with all of you here, I'm still thinking of Lungi and how lucky I am to share my life with her. Of course, there are others here today that I have to mention that enriched my life and Lungi. A special thank you to the Tuala family for, for being my family away from New Zealand. There has always been love and respect from them and gentle ribbing from them to keep you level-headed. I know some of this from me may be a surprise because I don't often express myself around you, but I take everything in and process it quickly, even the gentle ribbon. I must make a special mention to Tamina's parents, Leal, who has always made me feel welcome, but spoil my kids too much. A little please, not too much. Victoria, the special act of gifting me the finances to travel to New Zealand when my father passed away will never be forgotten. Thank you. And thank you for Uncle Mike for being the MC here today and Father's Billy Pope, Thai Sali, for the ceremony. Finally, I wish to end on my own family members that have made it from New Zealand. My uncle Malcolm, which he touched briefly, makes an excellent representation for my father. My sister Charlotte and her family. And finally, to everyone. Enjoy the day. Me and Lungi will cherish this forever. Yeah, we love Sumala out.